it's a filing cabinet. But a really good filing cabinet at that. So let's talk about it. What is up everyone? How you doing today? My name is David DeFranco from DavidDeFran.co. Okay, so my voice isn't 100% back yet, but as you can hopefully hear, it's getting there guys. It's getting there slowly, day by day. But hey, in my opinion, it's certainly back enough to start making videos again. So for today's video, I figured why not jump back into the madness and talk about a filing cabinet. I know. I know exactly what you're thinking. David, really? A filing cabinet? You have an Android tablet in your house that you have yet to talk about. You have this setup behind you which you haven't really discussed in a while. Why are you talking about a filing cabinet? Well, two very important reasons. Number one, first of all, Autonomous was so nice enough to send it to me. So it's my duty, my call of duty, if you will, to provide a review of a product that was sent to me for free. So Autonomous, if you're watching, thank you very much. I love your products. Keep up the amazing work, and behind me just happens to be the L-shaped smart desk that I did indeed buy myself. And number two, I actually do need a filing cabinet, guys. Seriously, I actually need a filing cabinet. This is something I've needed for literally years now, years. And while I'm mostly digital, I do have to occasionally work with paper here and there. Example, tax season. Once a year, I see my CPA for taxes, and I have to print out all my earnings and all that stuff. And while it usually goes into a folder, and I put it into the corner of my office right behind this camera, just sitting on the floor in some kind of little dinky, rinky dinky metal filing cabinet. It's not even a cabinet. But anyway, yes, I do need a filing cabinet and I'm happy to say I finally have one. So with that said, this is kind of an awkward product review because it's so low and I can't exactly put it on my lap. So let's hit the floor. Okay, so this is where I currently keep my autonomous filing cabinets in the corner next to my autonomous L-shaped smart desk. I love it. I mean, as you can hopefully see, they, they match incredibly well, uh, which obviously should make sense because autonomous, autonomous, apples to apples. You gotta love it. Okay, so for this video's purpose, I'm gonna roll this out temporarily into the center of my room and do my best, yeah, just to talk to you from down below. So today you guys are above me, all right? You guys are the better people. Usually we're equals, but today you're above me. Enjoy that. Thankfully, it is on wheels, which is a really, really nice touch. All right, there she is. The autonomous filing cabinet is 15.6 inches in length, 19.7 inches in width, and 23.5 inches in height. Now, I'm no filing cabinet expert, obviously, but I have to say, it's pretty much your typical filing cabinet um, size, dimensions. And it weighs 46 pounds, which I don't think is that heavy. Now, of course, it's gonna get much heavier once you actually put documents in it, but uh, that's just common sense right there. However, this is not common sense. Something very important to know, this does have a weight capacity of 200 and 75 pounds. All right, so in terms of its construction, it's actually made out of super fine cold rolled steel plates and it is indeed treated with an anti-rust finish. And of course it does come fully assembled. It's kind of weird to have to say that, but I have to ask you guys this. Have you actually ever assembled the filing cabinets? I, I guess some filing cabinets out there do exist where you have to build them yourself, but I'm happy to say I didn't have to assemble a single thing with this filing cabinet. So autonomous, thank you for that. Less work for me. Is this awkward yet? Cause it's a little awkward for me. Okay, let's sit down and let's get comfortable. This is probably the, the most unprofessional video review I've ever done. But again, it's a filing cabinet. So it's, it's kind of awkward to do on camera as it is. So guys, I'm doing my best. All right, so as you can clearly see, I chose the white and gray combination. Now when Autonomous gives you a color option, by default, every single filing cabinet is fully white on the exterior. But when I talk about color, I'm talking about the interior of the little handles for each drawer, which is definitely a nice touch. So for me, I personally love the gray and white combination. But if you don't like gray, you can also get white and blue, white and green, or white and red. There are three drawers with plenty of space for storage. So up top here, it's pretty much, you know, nothing too fancy. Um, and you do get this included tray for like pens and little knickknacks that, are, you know, you just want to throw in there. Now, obviously, as you can see, I'm not really using mine yet. There you go. They slide into those trays and you slide it back in. 
Now, of course, the bottom drawer is the longest, and you're probably asking yourself, well, David, what do you use this filing cabinet for? Is it for some super secret confidential documents that just talk about your life secrets and everything like that? No. It's a glorified Pokemon card storage thing. And you know what? I'm very, very, very much okay with that. Uh, so for instance, I'll take out this binder and you can see I do indeed have a bunch of Pokemon cards in here. So not bad, not bad. Now guys, it's no secret. I am definitely a Pokemon card collector and I love it. It's a very expensive hobby. So it's just nice to have everything in one place. I'm just trying not to hit the camera here. But yeah, with that said, this obviously does fully extend. Look at that. Plenty of space. You gotta love it. Right, come back here, baby. Come back here. Not only that, you can lock each and every drawer with a single turn. So check it out. Locked, locked, locked. So in other words, you ain't touching my Pokemon cards, all right? Get out of here with that mindset and boom, that easy to unlock. And for me personally, I just put the keys down here. Now, of course, if you're gonna lock this, you're not gonna have the keys in there, I guess that's physically impossible, but if you wanna put these keys on your desk, or your other drawers or whatever, then you can. But me, again, I don't, I don't see any need to lock my filing cabinets. You might, and you probably will, actually. And finally, as I mentioned in the beginning of the video, it's on wheels. And I gotta say, it is very, very smooth. And for someone like myself who is constantly changing their mind and wanting to move furniture around, that's a beautiful thing, guys. Wheels do really make a huge difference. Big boy David is off the floor. But seriously, guys, the autonomous filing cabinet, as of today, sells for $249, including free shipping and a 30-day risk-free return policy. But of course, if you wanna save 5% off of that $249 retail price, you can do so by using my code right below. Autonomous, thank you so much for sending out this filing cabinet for review. I truly, truly do appreciate it. I can't express this enough, guys. I've needed a filing cabinet for years and it's really, really nice to finally have one, you know, that I can just call my own and I can put it in the corner. Again, it just fits perfectly over there. I love it. And I've never liked a filing cabinet so much before, so I guess that tells you something. Anyway, guys, thank you so much for watching. If you have any questions about this filing cabinet, please comment right below. Don't forget to like. I appreciate your support. And I'll talk to you soon. Stay safe out there. Peace.